continuing coverage of double a northeast league baseball is on the air today we've got a good match up ahead between the flying squirrels of richmond and the somerset patriots we've got baseball on the show and it's coming up next Striding in is Will Wilson. He will lead this one off today. The 1-1 home. Is swung on and missed for strike number two. Our temperature, a very comfortable 72 degrees as we get things started. Still a ball and two strikes. Ready to deliver the one and two. <laughs> You can bet these hitters are taking note of what the guy on the hill is working with. A long at bat like this in the first inning can reveal a lot. Fastball, strike three called, and he's caught looking to begin the afternoon. Your Matt Crook please. is forced onto the now mound now following the, the injury. Number 51. Digging in will be Elliot Ramos. One out, nobody on. Hit down the third baseline. But this will be a foul ball as that evens things at two and two. Trying to nibble here and he misses to run it full now. Three and two. Boy, that's one of the toughest pitches to lay off. A hard breaking ball at the back foot. Tough take on a terrific pitch. And he lays off here, ball hurt. four, and he'll become the, the game's time. first base runner here with one away. Luciano. Swinging a soft liner in there, a base hit. That is four. The left Hunter. To the plate now, Hunter Bishop down the left field line and deep. And that will end up a foul ball. In the air, down the line and left. But this is just going to wind up being a foul ball. Side corner. He's earned the right to live out there with the fastballs as that's out number two. Three and one. Here it is. You got a full count. And he misses with it for ball four. So the bases will be loaded now with two away. To the plate now is the designated hitter, Luis Toribio, and a golden opportunity here to give his guys the lead with three men aboard. Ready with the 2 1. A little too tall that time. Three and one now. Oh, and he has some trouble with it. The run is in to score, and they take an early 1 0 lead. So now to the plate, Jason Krizan. One by two swinging just out in front of the slider. Good plate discipline to lay off the slider that time, and he draws even a two and two. Here's the two and two. Jacob Gonzalez would be next. He set the payoff pitch. Late on that one as it's fouled off to the left side. Oh, and it misses ball four, and that will force home a run. At the plate now is Jacob Gonzalez. Eighth batter of the inning now with the bases loaded and two away. A swing and a shot hit down the corner. Mm, 
would have been a grand slam. Instead, it's a foul ball. I mean, he's coming right after him, Matty. Three fastballs in a row. Now, here's a fly ball. Well hit. Right fielder looking up. Still going back. Gone! It's a grand slam. Brian Keller comes on to work much now earlier than anticipated, obviously, as he'll try and right the ship in the very first Warrior. inning. Keller. At the plate, Luis Matos. Right there at the belt, one, one and two, two now. Strikes. Hard hit towards center. Dominguez is there and he puts it away to stop the bleeding. Stepping up is Jason Dominguez. It'll lead things off here in the bottom half of the first. No offer on that one. Two balls and a strike. Hey, great job by the offense right here to put a number up on the board and allow this young gun to go out on the mound, relax a little bit, and establish that good fastball. Throws in time, and that's out number one. So next to bat will be Michael Veltre. Now the one and one pitch. Takes a pass and misses. That's strike two. Bases are empty, one man out. Able to protect the plate with two strikes, and he'll see another one. I think for every player, for every former player, that swing right there is the reason we need to extend the netting without question. Want the fans to be safe. And he'll take it onto the bag himself. Two gone now here in the first. That is third. Now to bat, the Brandon Wagner. Man. No one aboard Brandon. for him, and two gone here in the first. Wagner. Here comes the one two. Nope, inside both. Two out, three. nobody on. And he's getting his money's worth up there now. It's full three and two. Well, you don't see it all that often, but this might be a good time for a three two change. If he can locate it, it's nearly impossible to hit. Another payoff pitch. Slider whiffed on for strike three. A great pitch to put an end to the inning. Stepping in once again is Will Wilson. He'll get us started in the top of the second. This is when you got to get selfish. You cannot get complacent or overconfident right here. These days don't happen often. When you got your foot on the accelerator and the entire offense is feeling pretty good, Get greedy and keep getting knocks and putting pressure on the defense. Back up the middle, and that'll get on by into center field for a leadoff single. The center fielder, number 14, Elliot Ramos. Into the box, Elliot Ramos. Popped him up. Bird has a play. Looks it into his glove, and there's one gone. Now into the box, Marco Luciano. He singled and scored in his first appearance in this one. Marco Luciano. The 3-1. Three, 3 and 2 now. Payoff pitch home. He is swung on and missed. He got him on strikes. That's going to bring up Hunter Bishop. Left fielder. Hunter Bishop. The 1-1 one, one home. Now a swing and little pop-up here right behind home plate. And he will indeed make the play in foul territory to retire the side. So stepping in is Antonio Cabello, and they are squarely into chip away mode, looking at a 6 0 deficit already in this one. Ball, and that's, that's okay. high for a ball. It's two and two. 
We just saw a fastball right there. I would not be shocked if he tries to get this guy to go fishing right here and drops a little off-speed pitch in the dirt. And there's your first out of the inning. Stepping in next, Daddy, Anthony Volpe. The shortstop, Anthony Volpe. Sent on the ground out to second. He's right there. Throw in time at first for route number two. Now to the plate, Trey Ambergy. Trying to make something happen with two gone in the bottom of the second. Ambergy. And he fouls this one off. Strike three called, and the inning is over. Top of the third set to get underway, and now it'll be the catcher, Patrick Bailey. Here comes the one two. Nope, that's down. On a good curveball, gets him swinging for wrap number one. And stepping yeah, in, Luis Toribio. Luis Toribio. Here comes the one two. Two balls, two strikes. Get back up the middle. And that'll find its way into center field for a one out hit. Now that the first baseman, Jason Krizan. Stepping in now, Jason Krizan. Two and two. Two and two. Swing and a miss on the changeup, and there are two gone. Next, it'll be Jacob Gonzalez. He's already got four RBIs in this one. Hit out towards second. He's got it. On to second for the force out, and the side is retired. Wilkerman Garcia as we move on to the bottom of inning number three. Keeping it down here as it's to one and two. I love everything this pitcher's got working right now. He's got presence. He's got great body language on the mound. He's got fastball command and a nice early feel for his off-speed stuff. Throw on to first is in time to get him. So that'll go down as a strikeout and a two to three put out for route number one. The 3-2 pitch. Line to the right side. That's a base hit. Their first of the game. Batting nut. The catcher. Into the box now. Austin Wells. And he misses 2-1. This is hit the other way out toward left field. Bishop is there to put it away, and the runner will be forced to retreat back to first. Up next, Jason Dominguez. He bounced out last time up. Bird is off of first with two away. Two two pitches, a fastball high, so it runs full three and two. Three two, two out, runner on first. Lots of possible out. But we'll have to press pause as that strike three to retire the side. All set for the start of the fourth. And next it'll be the outfielder, Luis Matos. He's set. Here comes the 1-1. One -one. High in the air and drifting out to shallow center. Volpe onto the grass. He gets there and makes the play for the first out. Now at the plate, here is Will Wilson, singled in his last Will. at bat. Wilson. Right side, but it's going to be a foul ball. One out, nobody on.
hit out towards second. Field it cleanly. And that's the second out. That'll bring up Elliot Ramos. He was retired after popping Elliot. out in his last at-bat. Yeah, I don't mind him trying to drive the ball in the air, but he can't collapse the backside, and that's exactly what he did in his last at-bat. Look for him to stay a little taller and keep that up. Oh. And the throw is in time to get him to retire the side. Leading off the inning, it'll be Michael Beltre, and they could use a spark from him here. From the windup, the 1 1 pitch. That's and the two. pitch misses low and away for ball two. Hey, usually the second time through the order, you start seeing an incorporation of some more off speed stuff. But this guy's locating and feeling three, really two. good about his fastball. Two back to back. 3 2 pitch. High in the air out to center field. Center fielder giving chase, and he tracks it down. Nice play for the first down. Next up, Brandon Wagner struck out in his last trip to the plate. Sometimes you just got to tip your cap to the guy on the mound. He's getting paid to try and get you out as well. Anytime it gets up there north of seven, eight pitch ABs, Sometimes it just comes down to pure execution. Let's see if he makes the adjustment right here. Next up is Antonio Cabello. Popped into foul ground his last time up. Bases are empty here with two men out. And that misses up and in three and one. Team's been struggling on offense. Let your D work for you right here. Pound the zone. Popped up. Wilson moving to his left. And that retires the side. Now at the plate, Marco Luciano. He singled and later scored back in the first, making him one for two so far. The 1-1 one, one. is in there for strike number two. Pops this one up. Wagner in foul ground. And he hauls it in for the first out of the inning. So now into the box is Hunter Bishop. 0 for 2 here to start the afternoon. The 3 2 pitch on the ground to third. Reined in. Throw gets him He's two out. down. Next to stand in is Patrick Bailey. 0 for 1 Patrick. with a run scored thus Bailey. far. Two out, nobody on. He got him. Lively fastball that time, and it puts an end to the inning. Ready to go for the last half of the inning. And coming forward now is the shortstop, Anthony Volpe. Down the third baseline. But uh, this will get foul. It's a ball and two strikes. He got the fastball where he wanted and just pulled off of it. This one's blooped out toward right center field. Wilson calls for it. One down. Riding forward now oh, is the DH, Trey Amberge. He's 0 for 1 thus far. Amberge. The 3 and 1 pitch. And now here's a ball hit pretty well out toward right center field. And that's into the gap and should be extra bases. And he'll reach second now with one away. Now batter, the second baseman, Wilker Bear. At the plate now, Wilkerman Garcia. Liner toward right center. And that's going to get down out there. And he's going to score with ease as the throw will be too late. Now that is the third baseman. Max. Standing in now, Max Bird. Just off the outside that time, laid off for a ball. 
fly ball out toward left center field. Left fielder is on the move. He makes the running play. Two down. Now to the plate. Here is Austin Wells. Fly down in his first at bat, so make him 0 for 1 so far. The 1 1. Garcia, the runner at first with two gone. Strike three on a pitch in the dirt. And that ends the inning. Top half of the sixth about to get started. And striding forward the designated hitter, Luis Toribio. The 1-1. One, one. Swung on, but fouled off to the left. Again, another foul ball. Here's another one, too. This is skied out toward right. Beltre is there to put it away for route number one. Next, here is Jason Krizan. 0 for 1 with a run batted in thus far. Bases are empty, one man out. And he takes one off the inside corner for ball two. Slapped hard the opposite way. Oh, and this deflects right off him. He'll get it into second. The tag, and he's nabbed, trying for two. In now, Jacob Gonzalez. Bouncer up the middle. And that finds its way through for a base hit. The right fielder, number one. Luis Matos. At the plate, Luis Matos. Timing just to tick off there as this one's fouled off to the right. Good spot for an RBI. Put the ball in play with the runner in motion. He could score all the way from first. Here's a blooper out toward left center. Cabello is there, and he'll put it away to retire the side. So the lineup flips over and digging in, Jason Dominguez. He's hitless in his two at-bats so far. Now the one-and-one one pitch. Swing, and he pops him up. And this is going to be a foul ball. And another foul ball. Maybe oh, trying to back him up a bit there with the fastball. Tough to take a pitch like that right there, especially in a 1-2 count. You almost get in that auto swing mode. Great job to work the count back to even. Swing and a miss as he couldn't connect on the two-seamer, and that's out number one. Next to hit, Michael Beltre. Right He's 0 for 2 Michael. in the ballgame so far. Beltre. Skied down the left field line. And it's a foul ball. One out, nobody on. Rounded softly down the line toward first. Throw just does beat him to the bag as that was pretty close. So now here is Brandon Wagner rounded out in his last at bat. Hit in the air down the left field line. And this will wind up a foul ball. And he struck him out, his seventh of the ball game, and that ends the inning. Beck Way is on to pitch from the bullpen now to start inning now number seven. For the Patriots, 
number 37. So the batting order turns over now and set to go Will Wilson. He's got a hit in three at bats to this point. Here it comes on one and one. Now a fastball is lifted into the air to shallow center. He dives. Did he catch that? He did. What a play there for the first out. Next, it'll be Elliot Ramos. No hits to this point. Bases are empty, one man out. And a change up here, but that's taken low in the dirt for a ball. Way, just 21 years of age, he throws a four seam fastball, a change up, a change up, and a slider. Cabello is going to get there as he backs up to put it away, and there are two gone now. So now to the plate, Marco Luciano. He's working on a one for three Marco thus far. Luciano. A ball and two strikes. One ball. I can't two imagine strikes. he was sitting on fastball at his neck right there. He is going to have to lower his sights if he's going to have any chance. He's got it. Throw cleanly it. into first, and that Ladies ends the inning. Highway Tank gets the call from the pen to take the ball for the home seventh. Number 51, Highway Tank. So here's the cleanup hitter, Antonio Cabello. 0 for 2 for him to this point. And it's fouled away. Swung on and missed. He didn't even come close to contact on a ball way out of the zone. One out. Now batting. Shortstop. Next to hit is Anthony. Anthony Volpe. Flew out last Volpe. time up. A 1 1. Swing and a liner. A leap, but he can't bring it down. Base hit. Now that The designated hitter. Trey. Stepping in now, Trey Ambergy. Still two and two. Slider strike three called, and that's a pitcher's pitch right there. Two gone. Now that. Now it'll be Wilkerman Garcia. He delivered an RBI single in his last trip. He's set, and the two one pitch. Volpe leads off first with a pair of outs in the inning. Fouled off. He's set. Here's the 2-2. And this one runs in on him as he can't get his arms extended. A great pitch there, and the inning is over. Ready to begin the eighth, and that'll bring in Hunter Bishop. A 1 1. Eight, two. Oh, a fastball swung on and missed, and for the second time today, he's gone on strikes. Now batting. Digging in, the switch Patrick. hitter, Patrick Bailey, Bailey. been a strikeout victim twice in this one. Ball. Hit the target, but this is low. Two and one. Two one strike. Here's a little chopper up the middle. And very quickly there, they're two gone to start the inning. And now here is Luis Toribio. So far, two for three in this one. Bases are empty here with two men out. A swinging bunt out in front of the plate. Throw the first, beats him easily, and the side is retired. Bottom of the inning now, and set to go is the third baseman, Max Burt. Here now the 2-2. 
that's popped up. And no one will get this one. Another try at 2 2. And did he hold up in time? A look down, and no, he went around at strike three. Now batting. So next to the hit is Austin, Austin Wells. He went down on strikes in his last at bat. Yeah, but it was a good changeup, Matty. Good arm action on that pitch. Look for him to try and stay back a little bit more. Let the ball get a little deeper. Don't be shocked if this pitcher tries to rush a heater right here. So he ran the fastball by him for the punch out. Austin Wells goes down for out number two in the bottom half. And this one runs a little too far in. Ball two. 2-1 two pitch is a fastball swung on and missed two and two. Wow, he's cruising right now out there. Four straight punch outs and working on number five. Swung on and fouled as it looked to make it all the way up into the concourse area. Yeah, you could tell he was ready for another fastball, but the pitcher went to breaking ball, and the hitter just fouls that one off. Not where he wanted that fastball to be, and it's three and two now. Popped him up. Bailey waits on it. And that's the third out. All set to start the ninth in this one. And here comes the first baseman, Jason Krizan. The 2 1 home. Hey. up the middle and this will make its way into center field for a base hit and the leadoff man's aboard now to open the ninth. Now that the third base hit. into the box now Jacob Gonzalez. Oh here's a shot out to right center. The runner from first crosses the plate it's now seven to one. The right field, number one, Luis Matos. To the plate now, Luis Matos fouled away. A ball and two strikes, here it is. Now a swing and a fly ball. But this is just going to wind up being a foul ball. is foul right side. The next one two pitch. Ball, that's out. No one out with a runner at second. And that misses there so he runs the count full now. You can certainly tell at bats like this one frustrate the heck out of a pitcher. But you got to find a way to stay composed and execute your plan. And he takes ball four, so a good job out of the nine hole in getting on base as we go back to the top of the order. Now the 2-1. Hard hit ball to second. That's in there. Base hit. Gonzalez rounds the corner and is headed home. And he's safe at the plate. And they're pulling away. They lead by seven. Yuendris Gomez comes on to pitch now, hoping for better results than the other arms that they've run out there in this one. So now to the plate, Elliot Ramos. And that misses two and one. Almost got him to go around, but instead it's ball three. I love the ability to hold up right there, especially with count leverage. I know you want to get aggressive in the strike zone, but he was able to notice that that wasn't his pitch. Dominguez will slide over and put this one away, and that's out number one. Next to dig in, Marco Luciano. He was retired via the ground ball last time up. Yeah, Matty, expect this pitcher to try and get the same result as his last at bat right here. The double play is in order. Anything on the ground, the way this defense is, they could certainly roll too. Hey, there was great arm action on that 3-1 changeup right here. He's got this guy thinking. That's the beauty right now. We go to a full count. Do you sit changeup? 
or do you stay with the heat? And not in time as he just crosses the plate in time. Now battle. The left field. At the plate Hunter. now, Hunter Bishop. Bishop. And that one yanked just foul. Wilson on second. Luciano at first, one gone. And he fouls this one off. Payoff pitch one more time. Line to the right side. But he'll barely have to move out there in right as he hauls this one in for the second out. Into the box. Patrick now Bailey. 0 for 3 with a couple of strikeouts for him to this point in the ballgame. And this is low, ball two. Two and one. He's got a couple of pitches to deal with right here, but he's starting to lose command of his pitches. It might be time to take a step back and try to refocus on making some good pitches. The 3 1. And that pitch misses for ball four. So some intrigue now as the bases are loaded here with two away. The designated hitter, Luis Corribio. And that's into the corner of foul ball and right. Ball Off two. the plate that time and a little high. It's two even ball. at two and two. two Rounded to third. Throw to second for the four shot and the side is retired. Set for the bottom of the ninth. And next to bat will be the outfielder, Michael Beltre. Here now the 2 2. I got three and two. Well, the 1 2 pitch didn't go his way, and now a miss there on 2 and 2. You know he doesn't want this at bat to get away from him, so I think we're going to see a challenge pitch on a full count. And the throw to first is in time, one gun. Digging in next, Brandon Wagner. He went down on strikes last time up. One out, nobody on. Just off the outside that time, laid off for a ball. Got him! And he goes down on strikes for the third time. So the next to bat will be Antonio Cabello. No hits in three tries so far. He struck out once. And this one's going to bounce up to the plate. An easy take there, and it's three and one now. Popped him up. Bailey is there. Makes the catch, and that's the ball game. Well, the tone was set for this game from the very first inning. They came out absolutely banging the ball around and took that great start to another notch in the win column. Nine to one is the way this one ends. Richmond came out swinging with a huge first inning that really set them up well. Sean Jelly gets the W on the mound. Matt Crook permitted six earned runs to come across in the losing effort. So that just about does it for Mark DeRosa, Dan Plezak, and our entire crew. I'm Matt Vaskersian. You've been watching MLB The Show. For more, make your way over to the new website, theshow.com. Fans, our final line score. First, for the victorious visiting team, nine runs, 11 hits, no errors. They left six men on base.